unlimited AI image generation that also for absolutely free of cost without any watermark without any kind of limitation of daily use that is correct you can absolutely use it in unlimited scale you can download it and use it commercially as well the best part it gives you quality images just like mid journey or even Leonardo and you don't need to know a lot of prompting as well it also supports consistent characters that you can produce with the help of this amazing tool and I bet you have not seen such a comprehensive tool anywhere before on YouTube. With that being said, if it interests you, then let me let you know the name of this amazing AI tool. The tool is called Pick Lumen or Pick Lumen AI and it uses Flux Snail technology as well in which it can produce some amazing, amazing images just like the ones that you can see on screen. The best part, as I told you, I'm going to share with you a secret in which you can actually create consistent characters as well with the help of this very tool. And again, as I said, this is absolutely free of cost. So if that sounds interesting to you, then please stick on with me till the end of this Piclumen AI tutorial because this is going to be a step-by-step -step detailed Piclumen AI tutorial where I'll go through all the secrets and I'll explore the tool to the fullest. So without further ado, let's jump over to my laptop and let me show you how Piclumen works. So let's dive in. Hey, so welcome to Piclumen AI and as you can see this is the URL that is piclumen.com and in here you can just come over here and click on launch app and from there you can sign up within any Google account that you wish to. It's absolutely free of cost, right? Now once you get inside of the tool, it actually gives you two parts. One is called the explore and then there is one called create, right? And on the explore there are a few things like random, then there is hot, then there is latest and then there are likes. Now as you can see, these are all different images that are being generated using Piclumen. The best part as you can see, it actually covers you up in all dimensions. This one right here, you can see it's a cartoon type of picture that it has and in here as you can see a comic artwork of children playing. So from here you can get the prompt you can copy this prompt and use it wherever you wish to the best part you can even go ahead and download this image as well you can enhance this image you can remix this image you can upscale the image you can go ahead and imprint within the image as well and you can also go ahead and check it out on a full screen and expand it as well so as you can see you can go ahead and do all of this stuff over here right so that's amazing that means you can actually go ahead and use anybody else's creation as well if you wish to see over here the kind of images that are being produced this one over here is a line art kind of image image right so you can produce line art images as well you can go ahead and produce anime kind of images as well as you can see over here so all of these is possible and i'm going to show you everything the best part as i told you i'll also share with you the secret of creating consistent characters with it so with that being said without further ado let's jump in so to create an image we'll come over to this create click on that and in here as you can see i have created this kind of this is the consistent character that i'm working with and as you can see i have placed her in all different dimensions as well now i'm going to show you how to do that don't worry but as of now i'm going to give you a tutorial on how you can generate any and every image that you wish to now in here you can find the prompt so let's go ahead and give it a simple prompt so I've given like a cute dog playing by the beach in a sunny beautiful day right now in here you can choose the model I'm going to choose realistic you can go ahead and choose anime as well to create anime images you can choose line art to create line art images you can also use flux one dot snail as well now this is a legendary thing that has been included I'm coming to this a little later now in here you get an opportunity to choose the aspect ratio depending on where you are going to use it and then you can choose the number of images that are going to be produced right now once this is done you can come over here on this prompt and in here you have an auto translate that means you can translate it into any native language you want to then you can also go ahead and enhance the prompt as well using ai and then in here you have got the prompt filters you can add filters like you can add negative prompts over here you can also change the cfg scale now the higher the cfg value is the more it will be confined to the prompt the lesser creativity of the ai and the lesser number on the cfg scale means more creativity from the ai right so you have to strike a balance then there's the steps again you can keep any steps the more the steps are the better quality images are going to be produced so i'm going to use 40 for this example you can go ahead and choose anything on the seed i'll come to a little later so let's go ahead and generate this as of now and let's see how this photo works so let's wait and it took less than a few seconds and look at this look at this quality right it like looks like th it has been really actually snapped right so quite amazing the detail on the shadow are quite good as well you can see a bright sunny day has been depicted all of that and look at the detail of this picture look at this i mean the every fur of this puppy is visible right so that's quite amazing now you can also check out the other versions and again as you can see the details are awesome even the image 
of the reflection is coming up so that's quite amazing stuff to have now that was about a uh, animal photo now let's go ahead and try to create a real human photo so i've given a beautiful indian lady aged about 20 in traditional red sari facing the camera right now again i'll keep the same value as in our previous generation and let's go ahead and generate and as you can see it has been generated over here so you can see the details look at the detail over here it's quite amazing right so the kind of output it gives is quite mind-blowing now in here i want to just tell you one thing say for example you want to use this as your consistent character just for an example then what you can do is that you can just copy this seed so let us do that quickly so now that we have done it we can also go ahead and save this so now let's go ahead and try to create the same character and this time I'm going to pose it as a doctor. So let's do that. So I've given use the same lady in a doctor gown in front of an hospital. Now in here you have got a image option. So just click on that and in here click on upload file and in here I'll choose the character. So it would be uploaded pretty soon. You can see it has been uploaded. Now let us delete the previous file that it had, right? So in here we are also going to go over to this filter and on the seeds are going to actually paste the value of the seed that we had copied now once this is done i'll click on generate and let's see whether it can create consistent characters or not so let's watch out and boom there you go you can see over here the same lady over here and now she has turned into a doctor so in this way you can actually go ahead and produce consistent characters as well so that's quite amazing now as i told you i'll let you know how to create consistent character that's a bit of secret and nobody else is showing you but after watching this tutorial you are able to do that right now let's go ahead and create a beautiful looking lady picture so let's create a prompt so I've given a prompt over here and you can actually use this same prompt as well. That's up to you. Now, let's go ahead and click on generate and boom, it would generate it quickly for us. So let's wait. Just look at the quality. Just take a look at the quality. Amazing, right? The, the kind of detailed picture it is. It's awesome. Really, you can compare it with any tool on the market. The quality is quite absolutely stunning. So that being said, that's how you can provide it with good prompts to get great results, right? So now I'm going to test it out with the anime generation. So let's go ahead and create an anime. And in here, I have supplied it with a prompt, right? So let's go ahead and generate this. Basically, it's a boy playing with his puppy. So let's see how it turns out. Look at this. Amazing, right? Amazing. I must say, this is quite a great quality to have. And you can see it has got you covered with different styles, but all of the detail in all of these pictures are quite amazing. I must say, look at this. This looks cute, right? You can go ahead and upload it anywhere you want to. So that's a kind of cool stuff to have. Now, you can also go ahead and do a line art kind of thing as well. So let's apply the same prompt over here and let's try for a line art generation. Look at that. Look at this amazing that sketch quality that it produces again this is quite magnificent kind of stuff to have and as i told you as, a, as you have already seen i've generated numerous things and all of that is rendered perfectly in a short time and it gives amazing results unlimited usage unlimited downloads without any watermark this is one of the best tools to have right now that being said if you are not that good at prompting you can just come over to this explore section and from here you can take inspiration say for example you want to create a picture just like this you can click on over here and you can copy this prompt and then you can supply it and it will produce similar kind of image you can make a little changes and you can customize it as well that's up to you so that being said it brings me to an end of this pick lumen ai tutorial and i really hope that you guys have found it interesting if you have help me with a like on the comment section let me know that you have loved it then i will go ahead and create some other tutorials just like this one and that can help you out actually so spread the love spread the word share it with your friends don't forget to actually hit the like button hit the share button and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel to get updated with such ai tools that can change your life with that being said it's your good friend shine bidding goodbye from you we'll meet again pretty soon somewhere over the internet until then take care of yourself and your families and don't forget to keep making money online signing off is Ryan, take care. Bye-bye.